Fest Festival of Indie Festival Games. Festival of Indie Games, because clearly I can't remember anything. So tell us a little bit about your game. Okay, well, um, it's a ninja style fighting game where you're in ninja training school and you're trying to beat up all your classmates. Um, because you're in training school, um, you're a little clumsy and you don't know anything about your abilities because you're, now you're learning. So, um, you got a hand of three cards. Uh, you hold them up in front of you. Um, then you hold the face out and you will get just anywhere from the number zero through 10. Um, so, if I, if so, I'm gonna fight my buddy here. Um, I will initiate a fight, and I will pick one of my cards, place down, and then you place one of the turn, and he beat me uh, two of the ten, and so since I lost, I will take a wound, so this purple card, okay. at the back of the card shows that I have a wound, anytime I'm showing three wounds, I am knocked out. The first player to be, uh, the last player standing is, uh, is the winner, so you're trying to knock everyone out. Okay, so you're making sure everybody can see you all the time. Yes, but but the cool part is is that now when I when I when I get a wound, it's facing, the number now is facing me, and I and I get a little bit more control over my hand because I can play that in a fight now. So now I can oh, see it now. you can still play the wounded guy in a fight. Right. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That makes sense. Yep. Yeah. Okay, okay. Excellent. And so you always so you always draw back up. So if I play a wounded card, I'll always draw a wound, so I'll never um, heal any wounds. Okay. And that's most of the game, but we have um, three item cards. Um, we have a shuriken. So this is the shuriken here. It says start of turn. You can pick up one fight card. Okay. So if I were to, okay, if I were to use that, mm -hmm. okay, I could pick maybe his lowest card, which is a two. Okay. And then it'll give me better odds to winning, and then I'll play this card, okay. and then I beat him. Gotcha. Okay. Well, if I had played this card instead, okay, and he had an, and Josh had an energy bar, which says reaction, replace your played fight card from draw pile. So he would take the top card of the draw pile, which is this, and hopefully now he beats me. So he got a six. Okay, that actually seems pretty cool. And yep. Pretty easy for the family to play since we are family yep. gaming now, yep. group. Now, cool part is my favorite thing in the game. We have more, more than two players here. Um, there's this reaction on a smoke bomb, this smoke bomb card. And mm. it's a, so you can join someone else's fight. So um, if someone else had a, like a higher number, say this was the, the fight, uh -huh. okay? Someone had a, like, a higher number and they jumped in. Um, so that was a six. Well, we had the lower numbers, we both get wounded at the same exact time. Oh. So in a, in a, this plays up to nine players, so um, any number of players can come in. The highest number on the table always wins, and everyone who played the lower numbers all, all take wounds at the same time. Okay? And this card also can be used at the start of your turn to refresh cards. So, okay. so if I'm looking, if I'm wounded like this and I have two, like, yeah. two cards, I can be like, I have a smoke bomb, and then I get two new cards, and hopefully in my hand they're better, and this time it was. So, and that's the premise of the game. And Excellent, thank you very much. Thank you.